I just washed my hair the other day and it's already greasy and oily. The struggles I have to deal with, as always. Ugh. Hi everyone, so today I'm back for another video for you guys and I'm going to be talking about my top 5 drugstore brow products. As you guys know, I already have a few of my top 5 um, product videos on my channel so feel free to go watch those if you want to but today it's going to be all about brows and drugstore in particular in, in particularly what in in particular um, so yeah um, I am still working on my high-end collection so um, there will be some I'm just trying to like try out some things and you know get used to them and see if I like them and then build up my like my top five products that I really really like but obviously you guys know I have a bunch of drugstore stuff so I definitely have a five a top five drugstore brow product list so if you guys want to know what those are then just keep on watching so the first product that i want to talk about is the nyx tame and frame brow pomade in the shade espresso now this is like a brow like very similar to the anastasia brow pomade i haven't got that personally but this one is super good and you can see like i'm nearly done with it i use this baby a lot now the thing that i really like about it is that it has a really really nice shade and it's very very long wearing and it keeps your brow hairs in place now my brow hairs are super long and they just move everywhere now sometimes i see my brows going towards the end and they're like all spiky here so this is where this comes in like really handy because it's it just keeps your brows hairs in place they will not budge the product would not move and it's just so good for the money you pay for it i i think i got this for around 10 pounds i don't know but everything will be listed in the info box and the prices and everything but this is really good and i just love it and there's a bunch of shades as well the next product that i'm going to talk about is really really cheap and it's the collection brow kit i think everything's rubbed off Oh yeah, it's the collection eyebrow kit. Now it comes with like three shades and you get a brush in there and I think you get a tweezer. I believe that's what was in there. Oh no, you get a gel. You get a gel in here, I forgot. But I don't know where that went and I really didn't like the gel to be honest. But the powders are really, really good. So you get like a really dark shade, a medium one and then a really light one. I personally don't really like the lighter one, I just really like these two and they're so easy to use and really affordable. Now if you're like starting to make up or you just want something really good in your kit, definitely go for this one because it's actually really good. I think it was like around £4 for the whole kit and I used this a lot when I first started my channel out and it was good because it was really affordable. Again if you're start looking to start a channel and you need more makeup go for this one because this one's super cheap and it's good quality as well. The next product is another palette and it's by Jar Cosmetics and it's the Brow Bar To Go. Uh, I got the shade in medium ebony. Oh sorry by the way the one that I got the one that I got for the collection one, I believe there's two of them. So there's a lighter one and there's a darker one and I got the darker one. And for the brow bar to go, I got the shade medium to ebony. And this one actually has a wax and then two other colours. Now you guys know that I like Gyro Cosmetics and they have really good affordable products. And this one is really good. But what I like to do is kind of mix the wax with the uh, darker shade and that creates like a brow pomade kind of effect. They are These are not as pigmented as the collection one but I actually really like this because whenever I get my brows done I don't need that much filling in to be honest. And I feel like this really gives this natural fluffy brow effect and that's what I love. Sometimes I just love that. It just it shows every individual hair and it just shapes them as you need them to and it looks super super natural. And yeah, that's what I really like about it. It makes your eyebrows look like Gigi Hadid brows kind of. I don't know, that kind of vibe. Um, but they just look nice and fluffy. I know that's a weird word to use, but they look really good when you use this. The next brow product is a brow pencil kind of thing, and this is by Sleek. It's the Brow Perfector. And I'm in the shade es uh, Espresso. I'm in the shade Dark, and this one is kind of like the Anastasia Brow Definer, but in a thicker version. And this is what it looks like. If I hit it, it will focus. So you get like a long bit on this end and then you get like a spoolie on the other. I actually really like this. This is what I'm wearing today on my brows and it's just so easy to use. The brow, the spoolie is a bit of like a cheap version but that is not going to stop me. 
It still blends out the product fine and it doesn't really bother me to be honest. I love how pigmented the formula is and it's super like waxy in consistency and I really like that as well. And I, yeah, I really like this one. Again, it's a drugstore product, you can't go wrong with this. I still have to try the Soap and Glory brow products because I've never tried them. And I know they come out with new stuff as well, so that's something I need to try soon. But I definitely love this, it's what I've got on today and I just love how it makes my brow lips. And then the last and final product that I really like is a brow gel, it's a tinted one actually. And this one is by MUA and it's actually a pound I believe. I got the shade dark brown. It's basically like a, a mascara brush but it's a tinted brow gel. Now again the thing that I really like about this brow gel is that it keeps your brow hairs in place. It's not like the Rimmel one because I used to use the Rimmel one a lot, the transparent gel, but it does not keep your brow hairs in place. I don't see the point of using it. It just goes flimsy throughout the day and my brows move out of place but with this one they stay in place. Now it's very easy to get like a blotch on your eyebrow with this one, you just have to go really really lightly and it's actually really good so if you're looking for a good brow gel that's really affordable then definitely go for this one and again they have other shades and yeah what I find about with this one is that my brow hairs don't move um, the pigment, the colour and the pigmentation is really good and it makes your eyebrows look very defined and like like it makes the eyebrow hairs show out really well. I don't know how to explain it but it really defines your eyebrow and yeah I really like this one. So those are my top five drugstore brow products. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Let me know what other top five drugstore high-end videos you would like to see. I do want to say a huge thank you for all the support you guys have been giving me lately. I literally I am overwhelmed by all your comments and likes and everything like it's just so weird like you guys, sometimes I read your comments and it just literally makes my day and it makes me so happy. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos if you haven't already. And leave me a sweet comment and I will see you in my next video. Bye!